Hi everyone, this is Andrea with Journals for Life Stamps. Um, I'm so excited to show you the new releases in the shop. This is a 4x6 Plant Lady stamp set. Um, it's got the Plant Lady, Plant Mom, you can stamp Crazy Plant Lady or Homebody. Little cute water bottle here. I love this little bell, this little bell plant. Isn't he cute? It's cute. Little cup. So this is in the shop right now, just released. All stamps come with a reusable stamp pocket. Um, no cellophane, just the stamp pocket. Just like that. And the other stamp I have in the same series, the Plant Lady series, is this cute little bitty uh, 3x4. It's got a fiddle leaf. It's got this little modern watering pot. A reminder to water your plants. This little plant right here fits in the planters. Um, it's a little, little less than an inch. I think it's about three quarters of an inch. And this little plant. So sayings are time to grow, new plant, plant lady. It's a smaller format. Um, both of them work great in journals, planners, scrapbooks, art notebooks. I've also seen people use them on cards and card making. The other stamp just released is this Beach Please 4x6 stamp set featuring calligraphy. So the calligraphy sayings are Beach Please, Salt, Sand, and Sea, Ocean Child, Summer Vacation, and Make Waves. My home, in this, my home is the sea. The cute little sayings here, and I'll show you some ways that I stamp this. Is give me some fruity drinks, and there's a little coconut drink, and then Beach Hair Don't Care, Summer. And these little symbols or, or icons are great for making motifs and stamping across the page. And I'll show you a little bit about that in a second. Also, a new release is this 3x4 Mermaid Soul stamp set. So, calligraphy writing, it says, stay wild, I have a mermaid soul. Got some little bubbles, some starfish, a little shell. And my favorite is that cute mermaid tail. So let me show you some ways that I used these. So for the Beach Please 4x6, this is a small format scrapbook layout that I put together. Um, these papers are from, you know, local craft stores. I stamped this I Have a Mermaid Soul. Look how pretty that stamps. And then here's the other side. I stamped um, these little symbols all the way up. I colored some. Some I just stamped in different colors all the way up to the purple, the mermaid tail. So that was a lot of fun to do. Here is a dashboard for my travel notebook. I really had fun doing this. You'll see this over and over again in some of my posts, but um, I really liked ha being able to stamp these elements they all work together and they look good together and stamping them around the page so this was a cute little quick layout i did for my travel notebook and then here is a dashboard or a cover page for my book here so again th the little motif across the page and this says give me some fruity drinks with a little coconut drink and here's a shell bed so just some ideas, last but not least. So I have some of these small format travel notebooks coming to the shop soon. I have them made locally because I just really liked them laying flat and I like the spine. Some of the other travel notebooks, the staples come out and I'm too lazy to stitch them up. So I have them bound. Um, it has a hard acrylic cover. But anyway, here is the stamping that I did. So you can see I stamped and colored, or I stamped and color, or I just left it black and white. It looks really cute all together, just stamping it that way. Also in the Beach Please is a four sticker set with mermaids. This one says Mermaid Soul, and this is what those look like. See, we get this to focus. So we have ocean hair, don't care, mermaid soul. Let's see if I can see what I'm doing here. 
Ocean Child and Wild and Free. Um, these come four in a pack. And here's a quick little dashboard that I put together for the Plant Lady. Just damped all around the page and masked the edges here with some washi tape. So it stamped right up on the edge. And then I just created this and stuck it on top. But all of these are in both of those stamp sets. And you can either leave them as is or you can color them in, whichever one you'd like to do. And this was a planner setup that I did featuring that cute little water bottle. So I hope that gave you some ideas and I hope you go check out those stamps in the shop. Thanks.